bringing encouragement to hundreds of students all around the county. It's all part of the annual Youth Leadership Conference that's organized by the Wendell Davis Foundation. 23 ABC's Carlos Correa is live from Central Bakersfield right now with more on the lessons these young people learn today. Carlos? It's life lessons most students won't find inside a classroom, but through personal stories, conference leaders hope to educate and motivate. 16-year-old Javon Rufus is listening closely. It's helping other kids and me by being, you know, influential to our lives because if no one else does it, you know, and if there's no one else out there doing it, you know, who will? He's participating in the Youth Leadership Conference, hoping to turn his life around. I actually think the foundation is doing something great because it's like a lot of students out here, you know, it's like two ways to go and people are stuck on which way to go and it's like the right way is the easy way because the, the hard way is, is not good at all. Leaders with the Wendell Davis Foundation organized the event. We're resourced to them. Inmates were invited to attend and share their experiences in jail and share with students exactly why they ended up behind bars. As you notice the, 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 the new fad in Bakersfield is there's a lot of crime going on. So we want people that's actually behind bars that can show, you know what, I'd rather have my life on the outside than the inside. And if you're doing the things we were doing, this is where you'll end up. Organizers say speakers who have gone through challenges in life help make the conversation a bit more real. We're just making the young people aware of the consequences. Uh, every action causes a reaction. Organizers also included colleges and career services to talk to the kids and start planning their future. Reporting live in Central Bakersfield, Carlos Correa, 23 ABC.